In this video, I'll take you through a quick guided meditation that will allow you to become centered and become calm in a relatively short period of time and also uh, teach you some ways of getting back to center when you experience turbulence in your life. So let's get to it. Before we begin the meditation, I'll just talk about centering for a moment. For me, uh, being centered means to be available, to feel that uh, I'm at my best or I'm, I'm doing well. Um, physically, it means that I'm not leaning too far forward or too far back, not leaning side to side. I'm here, my back is straight. I'm comfortable, I'm relaxed. Um, I'm not holding too much tension in my body. And I'm generally available. I can move forward. I can move back. I can move freely. Emotionally, for me, being centered means that I'm not caught in the future. I'm not worrying about something. I'm not lost in a daydream. I'm also not concerned about the past or, or replaying some conversation or anything. I'm, I'm truly present and um, I'm emotionally available as well. For me, centering also means that it's kind of like a home base where I feel I feel good, I feel complete. Um, I feel content. Doesn't mean that my life is perfect, but I'm okay with whatever is coming up in the moment. So it's a nice place. Um, you know, when I was a kid, you'd play a game of tag, and as long as you were on home base, you could relax, right? And so for me, being centered is that place where I can recharge, I can regroup, and I feel generally uh, a sense of well-being. So all that being said, uh, we'll begin a, a guided meditation for a moment. So take a moment and find a comfortable seat. I would have your back relatively straight, but not, not rigid, but sort of relaxed, your head balancing on your body. You can close your eyes and begin to notice your breath. It's always nice to notice your inhale and your exhale. Begin to notice any sensations that are going on in your body. You can notice your contact with the chair. You may also be aware of sounds in your background. Any sounds in your head. And for this practice, you can also notice any thinking that's still there. And there's nothing wrong with that. It's just beginning to getting to a place where you can notice your thought and observe it and not be lost in it. Again, come back to your breathing and notice what it's like to feel generally well in the moment, in the present. If a thought pulls you away, Reassure yourself that that thought will be there when you're done, if it requires your attention. And you can begin to notice times and places where you feel centered, where you feel at your best. Perhaps it's times when you were in nature times when things were quiet, or at least where you had an inner sense of quiet, an inner sense of calm, not moving into the future, not receding into the past, but fully here in this unique moment, this moment in time, 
Now, from time to time, turbulence comes up in life. And when it does, you can notice any repercussions in your body. And again, just notice versus getting lost in those sensations. Acknowledge them. And then return to your breathing. Sometimes when we're walking, we might lose our sense of balance for a moment. We might get caught up in something. And then catch yourself and come back to your center. You can lean forward and lean back, lean from side to side. And in swaying, either way, there's a moment where you return to your center. Return to your center physically, emotionally. Returning to a sense of calm. Now, sometimes activity speeds up. Life demands more of us in the moment. And yet we can still be alert and awake and centered. So centering doesn't mean that we have to be completely internal. We can widen our focus. We can view things peripherally as if you were standing on the top of a mountain and surveying a landscape. And as always, return to your breath. Return to sensation in your body. Notice your thinking. And know that this is a place that you can return to at any moment. You can get there in a few moments at any point in your day several times a day. And with practice, you can get there in an instant. Whenever you need to regroup, whenever you need a pause or a time out, the moment can expand so that you have all the time in the world to gather yourself in a moment. So now, again, return to your breath. And begin to bring your awareness back into the room. If you haven't done so already, you can let your eyes flutter open. I always like to have a big stretch when I come back from a meditation. And you can take this centered state with you for the rest of your day or evening and be available for whatever comes up. <laughs> 